And this welterweight matchup is officially underway. It's a lot of support in the house for these boys. The crowd is loud for this one. Oh, Galvan opening up early with some strikes. There's no filling out process for this one. He has been waiting for this, and he is having a good time. Galvan looking nice and relaxed there for his mixed martial arts debut. Coming out with a head kick. A little bit unorthodox striking there from Galvan. A little bit keeping those hands low. That just shows a guy that's really relaxed out there. Spent a lot of time working on his boxing. Sometimes you got to be careful coming out hot like that because your opponent is really getting a gauge on you right now, and I think that's what T. Cooper is doing. Looks like there's some heat behind those punches of uh, Galvan, though. Yeah, Galvan is not pulling anything, just swinging away with everything he's got. Coker staying nice and composed. Looks very seasoned. He's been looking for the opening for his shots. He's got to be careful lunging in against Galvan. Another overhand right by Galvan. Just short of the money. I would love to see some head movement from Cook here. There we go. He's able to slip that barrage. Got clip with like a small jab there towards the end. With all this action, I want to see if Galvan can keep up this pace. Or will he get tired? Oh, nice straight right down the middle there from Coker. Both fighters ducking dangerously low. Yeah, they run the risk of butting heads when they do that. Little feints here from Cook. Jonathan Galvan comes from a very well-known gym run by Jason Solis, known for their Brazilian jiu-jitsu aspect, but right now he's showing some really good boxing skills, wouldn't you say, B? Yeah, Jason's well round He knows what he's doing. He's been around for a long time. Oh, peppering shots there from Coker. Coker's really accurate here and patient. Coker looking for his third victory here tonight. I would love some body shots from Coker here. They're both head hunting real heavy this first round. Just under 10 seconds left in this welterweight matchup. Oh, big Beautiful. accurate right hand there. Last 10 seconds, exciting. Not a letdown at all. I'm excited to see how they're gonna adjust in the second round. Nice precision there from Coker. Probably give him a slight nod in that round. Be sure to follow us on our social media, Fury FC on Facebook and Instagram. Let us know which fight you thought was the fight of the night. Curious to see if we'll see any takedown attempts from Galvan this round. Didn't see a single takedown attempt from either fighter. They were looking really comfortable on their feet. Yeah, they both look like they're having a good time swinging and banging out here in Houston, Texas. I don't think we're, I, I really don't think we're gonna see any takedowns here. I think they're gonna bang it out. We'll see who's gonna take it, the aggression of Galvan or the precision of Coker. Round two, here we go. Jonathan Galvan making his mixed martial arts debut. Looks like a seasoned vet with how comfortable he is out there. He does. Needs a little urgency though. These rounds are short and Galvan is getting out quite oh. a bit of strikes here. Forced to slip there from G Coker. From that leg kick. Good head movement there from Coker. Yeah, but I'm not loving the ducks right now. Very dangerous. Coker now countering. Body shot from Galvan. Galvan is kind of starting to bait Coker into a little brawl here, and Coker needs to be careful. I don't think he'll win if it's a brawl on brawl. Just to stay composed here.
Oh, nice counter there from Coker. Beautiful offline cross. These leg kicks are, I want to see more leg kicks from Galvan. Well, one, two there from Galvan. Galvan is visually deceiving right now. He looks tired, but he's not slowing down. And right at the halfway mark of this fight. Again, I would love to see some body shots. There we go. We have this intriguing matchup between welterweights Trayvon Coker and Jonathan Galvan. Big one, two there from Galvan. Galvan nods. Galvan is going for it. Galvan is loving this right now. Galvan with that warrior spirit. That Mexican warrior. Man, I'm telling you, the toughest I've ever seen. Just under a minute left in this second round. Coker's starting to check these kicks. Good on him. Coker seems very composed, but Galvan's getting a lot of points out there. With the leg kick. Oh, nice counter hook there from Coker. Beautiful as Galvan lunges in. Another one over the top. Coker now, sharp shooting. Second round in this book between these two welterweights. Galvan is gunning for blood. I think this third round is going to be quite eventful. Intriguing matchup between the precision and technical ability of Coker versus the intensity of Galvan. Who do you like so far, B? You know, to be honest, um, usually I like the technical fighter, but Galvan is not slowing down. He's getting more punches. Coker is looking real technical, but I think he needs a little more urgency. I think he needs to get out there and do a little more. Both breathing fine. I don't think either of them are gas, so we're in for a good third round. You have to wonder, Jonathan Galbao, going into this third round, He's gonna try to make something big happen in his MMA debut. Can't be certain. If I was his corner, I'd be telling him to fight like you're behind. Galvan moving a little more, a little more faint, a little, a little level changing here. Leg kick there from Coker. Love to see Coker follow that up with something. Galvan answers back. Galvan looks fresh. He's moving. Gunning for some body shots here. And as you say that, Coker not even breathing hard. Both these guys are in phenomenal shape. Beautiful precision cross. Oh! Snuck in that jab right there. Galvan says to bring it. It's interesting, Coca keeps changing stances right here. Oh, shoulder rolls there from Coker. I think Coker's waking up, guys. I think we're about to see some good action. Let's go. Man, I'm impressed with the technical ability, offense and defense of Coker. Right. And impressed with Galvan, too. I mean, this is a guy that's not looking like it's his debut. I think Galvan is slowing down and Coker is about to headbutt right there. Gotta be careful with that. I think that one hurt Galvan a little bit. Either way, I'd love to see both of these fighters again. Right. Galvan, a very entertaining fighter. Super game. A little bit of blood coming out of the right side of the eye of 
Coker, I mean, I'm sorry, from Galvan. Yeah, it's those precision crosses that. And Galvan lands that a solid Coker's left been. himself. Here we go, we're gonna see some groundwork here and one minute left in the fight. Coker scores. He's Can he jumping eager on the back here. He's gotta be careful. Can he take advantage of his position? He's got that one leg kind of high. Now he's got the back. He does have the seatbelt in, so I think he's safe there. Short time left. Coker in the position to get something big here. With short time like that, I would jump off and do some damage. I would do some damage here from Coker. Be the smarter thing than to be hunting for submission. Galvan looking at the back door. Can he shake him off? Or are we going to see an armbar attempt from Coker? It's very high right now. Coker should jump off and do some damage. Galvan might be able to sneak on top. Galvan trying to come up. Here we go. Just under 10 seconds left. Coker looking to land something Coker big. Is landing. There's so much action right now. 10 seconds left. These boys are going for it. And these two fighters go the distance. Trayvon Coker and Jonathan Galvan with one hell of a welterweight fight. They hug it out. There's no bond greater than going to war. These two guys did just that tonight. As we await the decision, I'd probably have to give that one to Coker. Yeah, he really pulled it out in the end. That's a great debut for Galvin, though. I'm impressed. Yeah, I definitely want to see Galvan back here soon in future Fury Fighting Championships. Clean up some things because you know what they say, you can't teach heart, and he's got that, so. Ladies and gentlemen, after three rounds of combat, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. Judge Ivan Guzman scores the fight 29-28 for Jonathan Calvon. <laughs> Judge Brian Thompson scores the fight 29-28 for Trayvon Coker. <laughs> and Judge Rob Alexander scores the fight 29-28 declaring your winner by split decision, Jonathan Galvan! And Jonathan Galvan with a split decision victory, winning his mixed martial arts debut. Awesome performance from both fighters. It was a close one. Nice job. Beautiful debut for Galvan. Big victory for Jonathan Galvan. Handing Coker his first defeat. Congratulations to Jason Solis and Texas Third Coast.